Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Grimwit. This is Bloodlust. The suggested movie today is Love at First Bite with George Hamilton as Dracula. No, no, I'm not, not kidding. And yes, it is a joke. Let's go back to Bunny the Criminal. There is no save function in this game. Instead, once you close the game, it saves for you. Ooh, good. I can high jump up here. I'm getting a better control. Well, I was getting a better control. Oh, you dark zombies. Okay, this guy's about to kill me. There we go. There. Wow, into the first challenging battle, I guess. What is our prize? A enhanced baby pen. An enhanced piercing slab. Why? 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 What? 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 I do not know, but. It's locked. Bloodstone required. Hmm. We don't have a bloodstone. We have a talent glyph. We have glyphs, but no stones. Hmm. Well, we have some things. Can I... I wonder if I can gaze past... Oh, uh, that was the wrong button. Let's try this button. Whoa. Okay, I can get through gates by gazing past it. And high jump while I'm doing it. <laughs> Super ledge jumping. So I can control myself while I'm gazing. Interesting. I'm just doing it blindly. Hello, dead guy. Well, the ability to look on past is interesting. I also noticed that I don't have two orbs this time. Hmm. So what happens if I run into this? Oh, that's right. I jumped up on the ledge. Nothing. Okay, head, level two. After editing the video last time, I realized that the head is not out to kill me. I was asked if I beat him into submission. I don't think so. And hey, where's our friend? Hmm. All right, so we need a key to get past that gate. Hello, stranger. Keys are five dollars. My god. I could have bought a steak. So let's see, what can I sell? Let's sell a couple of empty bottles. I also noticed right here that apparently because of my persuasion skill, I haggle down prices. That's cool. Hmm. No, no, I'm about to get to a point where I can use those. So let's sell these empty bottles. It's a worthless ring. Well, if it's worthless, and I only really needed four dollars for this key. Let's grab it anyway. And let's go talk Goodbye. to the ancient statue. Do, do you mind not following me, head? Go, go away. You, you creep me out. 
I should be able to look past here and see what's in here before I walk in. Let's do that. Oh, I can use the mouse wheel to adjust speed. Oops, sorry. Hmm. There's really nothing in here except this thing. Another pledgeling finds themselves in exile again, I see. If you are to escape the ruins, a bloodstone is necessary to unlock the door. Where do I find the bloodstone? Also, alright, I figured out that these are clan symbols. Huh. The Vangris clan. So I guess this statue belongs to the clan. Also, the head gets bored. What? what Don't be foolish. It must be made. Go quickly and find the necessary ingredients to make the bloodstone. Okay, I guess. And I can check journal for more info. Uh, also, it looks like I can't persuade. Maybe my persuade is not high enough. Nope. Interesting. So it's not a chance that I can persuade. I either can or cannot, depending on how high my persuade skill is. Good to know. Sounds easy enough. Let's... <sighs> J for journal? Yes. Create the Lost Bloodstone. Alright. I need to find a cauldron. I need snake eyes. I need elixir. Oh, secret. Cauldron's behind a secret door. You need to learn secret site. Show on map. That makes it pretty damn easy. I guess that would be it. So, south past this gate, which means I need another key. Huh. For some reason, I figured this would be a lot easier, faster, something. I suspect this is not the gate. Oh, I need to turn around. Nope, not this way either. So wait, do I need the bloodstone to create the bloodstone? No, no, I'm again going the wrong way. Oh, okay, I get lost. If you are new to my channel, hello, I am Grimwit. I get lost. Before, we had to deal with this. Haha, <laughs> you missed me! Stupid jerk. Now I guess it's the time that we actually delve deep and start dealing with this. There should be a couple of zombies here. Uh-huh. If I had five bucks, man, I would take care of you so bad. There we go. And he left me... a big knife. Woo. Okay, let's check out our inventory. Right now we have just a regular knife, which does two to six. Oh, and they have durability, because that's always a good thing, right? This is magic. Full durability does 10 to 10. I can use it. Let's grab a scroll of identify. Oh. Well, what's so special about it? Oh, it finds items for me. Alright, well, let's... I'll sell the old knife. And so our Diabloness is complete. Oh, and I forgot to add... I have plenty of battery life so far. Ah, what? Oh, surprise! There we go. Alright. Now we're cooking with Wesson. That's something they said in the 1920s when Bunny was alive. Hmm. Hmm. 
Oh, I'm getting too close. Spider. He is our hero. Oh, Christ, this thing's big. Stamina too low. Do not run or jump or swing. Uh. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> sure, let's wake up. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, so, laser spiders. Ah. I did not expect to encounter laser spiders. Hey, I just noticed the switch. Huh. Any laser spiders in here? Hmm. There's one of those cracks I was told about. Well, let's try it. Hmm? Interesting. It's trapped. I've already died once today. Let's try it again. Poison. Melee less damage. That's all. Note. Magnifying moon. Let's, uh... The door will open if the sun's ray appears near the entrance from where you are, reflected and magnified against the earthly moon. The lever is the same key used to enter the room. Your gaze won't burn like your flesh can, so use the orb from where you stand. Okay, that's a pretty simple clue. So let's, uh, let's give it a try. First, let's turn off the flashlight. I don't really need it. And let's try the gaze once more. Okay, I'm starting to get used to controlling the gaze. And I guess we need to run into this lever. Now, how do I stop? Okay. Oh, hey. Hey, it's that coloring book we once saw. Hmm. I can't look at it. Is there no mode for first person? Hmm, trapped. Sure, Ryan, why not? I'm good with traps. No, I'm not. A rusty dagger, I can sell that. 61 wooden stakes, holy shit, that's like, that's like gold. Also, gold. <laughs> so, all in all, it's a good day. Okay, there's got to be some way to switch to first-person perspective. And the people outside are super excited. I don't know if you can hear them celebrating the Lord downstairs. Give me just a second. I'm, I'm sorry. Just had to point, put this in real quick. Left Alt is the Alt key. And now we know. Mm, there's no way to change camera view. Uh, developers, I'd appreciate it, but you don't have to. I don't really care that much. I just would kind of like it. Resuming. I wear my sunglasses at night. So I can, so I can. There we go. Keep track of the movements in my eye. Okay, that was cool. So, let's see. I think we could keep going. What is this? I just noticed it. Oh, those are slots, I guess. And they're Vangress clan. But they're also not as good as my current. Oh yes, and my 61 wooden stakes. I'm gonna 
teach that laser spider who's boss. I just went the wrong way. There you are, laser spider. We meet again. Where'd he go? Is he dead? He is now. Take that, laser spider. My old enemy. Let's see. He dropped a wooden stake. And normally you would think, ah, oh, wooden stake, who cares? But, like, wooden stakes? Man. Those things are expensive. Okay. Elixir, got it. So, really, what we need now... Is some snake eyes. Just checking. Whoops, didn't mean to. What? Spider egg? Any bad guys? No. We got more elixir. Leather, leather gloves that I might actually be able to wear. No, I cannot wear those. Man, I need to raise my strength up if we're going to keep doing this dance. Hey, another egg. An axe? <laughs> okay, we're, we're going to be selling quite a bit of stuff. Also, I just realized that I have a quest item option. Of which I have none. Okay, we still need some snake eyes. Hmm. Where? Close to a pit or something. Let's not hit that switch just yet until I know what I'm doing. Hmm. Mysteriouser and mysteriouser. Is this place familiar to me? Let's disarm this trap. I am so good at disarming traps. At least I got a gate key. Snake juice. Could be useful. The gate key will certainly be useful. Actually. Yeah, I'm on the other side. I'm on the other side of the gate key. In fact, yeah, I was here. Oh, what's up there, bum? I seen some guy go right through that wall right there. I'm not drunk, I swear I seen it. Go back to sleep. Which means we need some second sight up in here. Yep. Hey, it didn't heal us. Zombie hearts? To create ember. Pants! Oh man, they're even used and torn. And goth boots. Okay. The goth boots are require minimum charisma. Pants I might be able to use. Uh, I just realized I'm not wearing any pants. How can this be? There we go. Yeah, raise that defense. Can't really do anything else right now. Hmm. Is this the cauldron? Yeah, that's the cauldron. I don't need that yet. I need some snake eyes first. Huh. Why don't I trust this? Okay. Okay. This all looks on the level. Looks pretty cool. Blue Ice. Convert Spirit Force to attack damage. That's actually really cool sounding. Maybe later. I don't have much Spirit... Oh! God damn it. <laughs> okay. Well, I want to see what's past there, so... It's some kind of, some kind of glowy orb. 
That's it. It's just a glowy orb. I don't know what kind of glowy orb. There's a locked chest. And a fancy Steam Age light. Hmm. Did I just hurt myself? Maybe. Let's do this. Okay. Um, I want at least an 18th strength. And we're going to pour the rest in... Hmm. There we go. Now let's see. We also need to... So, so what do I get if I put more into lockpick. It increases the percentage of working. What's a skade? It says five skade reputation. So which clan you are in with controls... Huh, that's interesting. Yeah, the order of these skills is not in any order. Holy crap, I just came across a ton more. Teleport. Set point and teleport back before timer runs out. What? There's a timer? Oh, come on. Okay, honestly, I'm just going to put it in lockpick. Okay, now I can wear these ringmail boots. And although I can use this, I don't need to because my current knife is better. I'll sell those. I can't wear goth boots. That makes me really sad. You have no idea. Hmm. Well, okay. Okay, I can just jump past it. Cool. Hi. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What? What? Oh, hell. <laughs> um... Okay, you just stay there. Can I get you in the head? Man. I think that worked out well. There's no... Well, actually, there's no anything. And also, I'm a thirsty vampire, so let's drink our blood wine again. And... After we talk to this thing, or grab it, or all oh god, not another one. What? What? How did you do that? You gonna get stuck too? No, he can actually move. Yay. Oh no, no, he's stuck. Um... Lizard, are you... Are you... Are you alright, Lizard? This has been a magical journey. Oh, fun times. All right, well, now, what is this thing? Because I want it. Looks like it's nothing. This is trapped, but I bet I can disarm the trap now. Wish there was a disarm trap skill. No, I didn't disarm the trap, and now I'm poisoned again. But I got a ruby. Quest item. Okay, okay. Thank you for that tutorial, which I turned off. But, um... Okay. <laughs> I just, I'm awesome. I am an awesome video game player. Everything about this is awesome. I'm affected by poison. <sighs> All right. With that. Oh my God. Wait. Have I been here? I'm lost again. All right, with that, we're going to call it good. 
and just say <sighs> fascinating and fun times in the vampire world gosh uh, I didn't realize that this would be so much fun um, <laughs> I honestly am having an awful lot of fun with this this is a pretty good game for what it is I will see you guys later and uh, go watch Love at First Bite